Back in 2009 at the Copenhagen summit, Lebanon has committed itself to go to 12% of renewable energy. Lebanon had initiated a robust and steady journey towards achieving this objective. The Ministry of Energy and Water adopted a detailed action plan following the European standards, offering quantitative and qualitative data on how the energy sector could move in that regard. The National Renewable Energy Action Plan for the period of 2016 to 2020 sets concrete targets for the different technologies, namely wind power, solar photovoltaic systems, solar water heaters, biomass, and hydropower. Today, the estimated market size of the sustainable energy has succeeded 700 million US dollars per year, with more than 400 expected to be invested in the country in 2019 and 2020. The Central Bank of Lebanon has also played a major role in supporting the market development, offering more than 1,000 subsidized loans and creating more than 10,000 job opportunities. The Minister of Energy and Water strived over the past few years to make renewable energy and energy efficiency high on the national political agenda. And I think we succeeded in doing so. The market for solar water heaters and decentralized renewable energy systems has been increasing steadily for the past seven years. And currently, we are evaluating proposals to build 12 solar farms with a total capacity of 180 megawatts all over the country. According to the International Energy Agency, IEA, Lebanon is considered among the top 10 countries in the world in terms of market increase for solar water heaters. In addition, the investments in the decentralized solar photovoltaic market reached 76 million US dollars in 2017. We are confident that Lebanon will reach its 12% target by 2020. All indicators show that the sector is moving in the right direction. Lebanon offers a great market potential for the different renewable energy technologies, namely solar PV, solar water heaters, biomass, hydropower, and wind. I had the honor to sign the first three power purchase agreements in the history of Lebanon in February this year. I signed them with three investors from the private sector to build 200 megawatts of wind farms in the northern Akka region. The three wind farms are expected to be connected to the national grid early 2020, with major financing institutions supporting the project's implementation. The Ministry of Energy and Water has launched also new bids to build 300 megawatts of solar farms with battery storage, as well as a second round of, uh, to build 300 megawatts of wind farms. We encourage investors from all around the world to join and contribute in this national momentum. As Lebanon moves firmly to reach its 2020 objectives, Prime Minister Hariri has launched a new target, 30% of renewable energy by 2030. The new set target for the year 2030 is surely a tough national challenge. However, Lebanon is working closely with the International Renewable Energy Agency in order to develop and implement the most effective, efficient and viable pass in order to reach our 30% objectives by 2030. The LCEC will spare no efforts to keep pushing the market forward, building on the positive momentum that exists today in the Lebanese sustainable energy sector, a momentum that relies heavily on the productive cooperation among the public sector, the private sector and the international friends and partners of Lebanon.